Hello there, people of the internet. I'm Cursed Blake, and this, finally again, is Dragon Quest VIII. I've returned after so much time. I think it's been like over a month or something since I last played this, but I've been really keen to get back to it. I think last time we basically uh, finished off the quest line. I can't remember exactly what we did, but I think we found out where Dolmegus was going. And yeah, let's just jump straight in. So as you might see, I've actually changed the way I'm uh, presenting this. I want to produce the little screen down the bottom all the time because I am playing on the 3DS. I do get that cool little screen, so it is super nice having it there. So yeah, that's kind of why I'm doing that. And uh, yeah, it's just nice. All right. So I think we go this way. As we can see, there's like a little red dot kind of to the south. So that's where we're going to kind of go. I'm going to try and avoid combat as much as possible because I'd like, you know, we don't really need to grind or anything. And, uh, yeah. I'm so glad to be back playing this absolutely classic 3DS title, and I think... I think it is my personal favourite of any of the DS games. Like, I know there's, like, all the cool Pokemon titles, but... This is a seriously classic Dragon Quest game, and for it to be handheld is just awesome. So I think it is probably my favourite. So if you guys haven't picked this up yet, go pick it up. If you can. <laughs> It is quite expensive these days, but if you can pick it up, go for it. Wait, is this the right place? Now, this is the stupid waterfall. Ugh, I'm an idiot. Okay. Let's go talk to Yangus. Yangus knows what's going on. All right, where are we meant to go? Uh, Kelda Russia reckons Dromegas headed south. At well, we did head south. As far as I remember, that town Alexandria is down that way. Why don't we try our luck there? We are heading south, right? Yeah, I could be wrong. Oh, maybe he headed south and then... He went the other way, because I think that's the way. I could be wrong. <laughs> I probably am. But we will make it to Alexandria. So basically, the background... Oh, we're going to fight this guy. The background for this game is the map of this world, and I will slowly move it around the further we get around. Oh, our capture comes... Over. Okay, kill him. Die. I forget we have cool attacks now. But yeah, a lot of this game is just going to be like... Just endless combat killing stuff, so... Alright, come on. Let's get him. We don't really need to worry too much about doing crazy attacks just yet. Like, I always get a little weird with this game, like, not using crazy attacks all the time. But I should probably just use, like, my cool fancy attacks. Okay, I don't need help. Abilities, that's it. Dragon Slash. Uh, maybe not Dragon Slash. That feels kind of pointless. We did get some extra points, which I haven't allocated yet, so that is one thing. Alright, here we go. Now, if I do remember... <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> okay, let's go. See, the thing is, this early on in the game, they just do no damage, so... Okay, I'm just gonna do normal attacks with me. I think he hasn't... Okay, he hasn't got a cool attack yet. Okay. I'm certain we got some cool attacks or something. Hmm. I mean, Yangus just kicks ass now. I think that's the thing. I think we have a ton of gold from last time. As I said, it's been like a month since I've played this, so... I'm planning on trying to keep this up a bit more now. Uh, I just kind of got distracted by other fun things. Uh, streaming over here on YouTube, which has been something I've been really enjoying. And uh, yeah, if you want to see more Dragon Quest, don't forget to like and subscribe. And leave a comment about what, what your favorite Dragon Quest is. And if this is the best 3DS game. All right, let's go. No more bubble slimes, get out of here. Yeah, we're just gonna go a bit cross country because I, I just want to avoid the road. I mean, it, it gives me a little bit more like, risk of hitting stuff, but hey, it's all good. It's a nice shortcut. I like it. Hey, we made it. I think this is the right way to go. Yeah, I think it is. I'm just going to assume because, oh, damn it. I didn't even see that one. I was just, I just looked away for, I was looking at the bottom screen. Some Drakis appear. Holy crap. All right. Die. But yeah, I think this game, wow, 36. That's, that's ridiculous. All right. So this game will have a lot of just like, kind of, not necessarily grindy combat, you know, just slow monotonous combat, I guess you could call it. But it's pretty quick. Like, I know I said it's slow, but it's like, you have to do a lot of it. I think that's the thing. Eventually these monsters will just flee. So, kind of cool. I want to kind of know what's up here. This is the problem with these kind of games. I see somewhere I can go. I think I should go through this forest, but I don't know if that's the right way to go. So I'm guessing when they said south, they meant, ooh, it's like a little flame dude. I don't remember that. <gasps> Wait, something's clipping out of existence. It must be important. Check, checkpoint. Wait, wait, checkpoint this way. Oh, wait, there's a checkpoint. I want to go this way, though. I don't ever remember. I don't remember this at all. 
So I did play a little bit of this game, like probably, so I think I've got to the next town and that's about it. This is really cool though, I like this. I'm guessing this, I have been watching some other like YouTubers, not actually watching the games, but seeing where they're up to on their like thumbnails and stuff. Hey, look at this dude. Can we fight this guy? Oh, is this guy a boss? Oh, is he just... I don't remember this thing at all. Okay, beat the crap out of him. Okay, no, he's not too nasty. Yeah, get him. But this is one of the... Like, this is what I really like. Because playing the... Because I have played some of the older Dragon Quest games as well, and... I didn't particularly... I, it's like the, the classic Pokemon thing, right? Where you run into the grass and you get attacked. I'm not a huge fan of just random encounters. I love this quality of life upgrade where you can run into sprites. I think that's much better. Alright, let's go. Pokemon only now has caught up to that. Okay, that guy that guy definitely wasn't a boss. Alright, kill. Cool. He must have been guarding something though. Oh, there's a couple of Beetle Boys around here. Okay. <laughs> I love it that they would name things like I would in this game. I don't know if it's just bad translation or just, you know, what <laughs> you know, whatever, but that's the kind of thing I would name something. Oh, wait, can we go through here? Nope. Okay. So that's that's an invisible wall. Okay, so I guess we can't go that way. I do want to check out this one tree over here. It looks kind of cool. But it's probably nothing because I know how these games are built and they're just like, hey, we're going to stick this really cool thing here. Doink. <gasps> oh, I really liked how the trees phased into, like, just kind of melted in there. That was nice. It was a nice fade in. I don't think a lot of these guys want to actually fight me because I think I'm high enough level to pretty much take them out pretty quickly. So that's nice. But yeah, I feel like now, this is kind of where, I don't know, we've put in what? We haven't even really done, put like two hours into this game already. Like, it's not, not that much, but I feel like it's a really nice, it feels slow, but also you do actually kind of get through the story pretty quickly if you don't just, like, grind like hell. Ooh. Whoa. That, that looks a little wrong. What's wrong with this? Someone's just, like, absolutely smashed through here. That's, that's not ideal. Also, why would you build a giant bridge here with gates, but no one there? That's, that's a little odd. Alright, cool. Oh, what's this? Ah, uh, it's one of those, like, evil toadstool guys. Alright, I want to fight him. <laughs> uh, I do love the sprite design in this game. It's just, it's wonderful. F f fungals. Yeah, that's it. Cool. We'll kick these guys' asses easy. Die. Oh, kicky boy. Oh, oh wow, did... okay. I honestly thought we'd go before then. Okay, cool, yeah, no, I, I thought I was a little worried for a second there, but it's all good. But yeah, I actually probably will be playing, after I finish my latest game on Twitch, um, I will probably be playing some more Dragon Quest over on the channel, so if you want to check that out, link will be in the description. Um, I don't know when this video will come out, so you never know. Might be in time or not. <laughs> Alright. But yeah, I am planning on trying to keep this this series going because I really want to finish this game and that's kind of one of the reasons why I wanted to make this series and because I think that the 3DS version of this game is amazing. There we go. Cool, we killed that guy. Those guys are actually a little harder, but you know what? We'll just avoid them. Oh, the little archer dudes. No, get out of here. And also, I, I want to go back to playing Dragon Quest XI too because I'm yet to finish it and I really like Dragon Quest XI. I just... It's a very long game. That's the biggest issue about it. It's just so long. All right, let's be let's go, Beetle Boys. Oh wow, okay. I I must have just I just must not be very fast anymore. These guys seem a little stronger than I am. Yeah, go Yangus. Yangus is just an absolute tank in this. Oh, Yangus. And yeah, I'm gonna. I'm not going to keep just one series going on the channel. Um, I will probably be doing multiple things, so... Yeah. It's going to mostly... At the moment, I've been kind of, like, just really into JRPGs. So I, that's kind of what it's going to be. SMT3 HD is kind of what I'm playing as well on the channel. So if you want to see that, subscribe and go check out those videos. Alright. No, <laughs> stop running. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> uh, hopefully we can get to the town. That's That's all I want. Alright. Oh, Yangus is really low on health. Please don't kill Yangus. I just realized how low Yangus was on health. Okay, please don't shoot. 
Okay, cool. Oh, okay. Um, I need to cast heal on Yangus. And Yangus just needs to, like, yeet this guy out of here. Oh, man. Oh, we're both gonna die. Okay, I probably should have cast heal on myself. But that's okay. Cool, I think we got it. Oh. Okay. Do we have any kind of, like, items that I can use? I don't have any items. This is gonna be, um... Gonna be bad. Okay, I'm gonna heal myself. And Yangus is going to... Does Yangus have any items? I really need to give these guys items. Damn it! Alright. I'll take out the other Bodkin Archer. Please don't. Have... Oh, yes! Nice! Yeah, that's what I like to see. Yeah, I remember there was a difficulty spike in this game, but I can't remember exactly when it came, so... There we go. Whack that dude. I'm gonna cast another, like, heal spell on Yangus. Just because he has an absolute chunk of health. Alright, come on Yangus, do the thing. Beat the crap out of them. And one other thing that I really want to play as well, and I've never played it, but, um, I've seen it played, is, uh, Dragon Quest Builders. Alright, let's go. Yeah, get him. Because I find, um, it's a really nice, nice, uh, kind of change to that sort of genre of game, and I think that could be kind of fun to play. Alright, let's get this beetle boy. Smash him! Smash him, Angus! Yeah! We got him. Nice. Perfect. Man, we need to, like, to get some, like, damn healing. There we... Yeah. I love that little, like, Mass heal thing. It's so cool. What's this? Wait, is this the checkpoint? Is this a town? Oh, this is cool. I don't- I honestly don't remember this town. I love the noises of this game. Just everything about it is just awesome. It's got that sort of old school vibe to it. Oh, it's so pretty. And like, this was a PS2 title. Hey, look at these guys! Halt! Who goes there? Oh, that's cute. Don't waste your breath, scoundrels! I can spot bandits a mile off. <laughs> I like his helmet, it's very cute. This is for Alistair. Come on, Mesh! Let's get him! I mean, Yangus will probably just step on you. Yes, sir, bangers! <laughs> bangers and mash. <laughs> nice. Love it. <laughs> Wait, we actually have to fight these kids? Oh, this. All right, let's get him. Get him, Yangus. What on earth are you two oh. up to now? Stop it at once! Damn it! I want to beat these kids up. No, <laughs> they threatened me. Come on. Of course, they weren't going to let us do that. Where are your manners? No way to if that old lady wasn't there, they would have just, like, shanked us. <laughs> well, that's probably where he learned the violence from her. I mean, she just, like, hit a metal tin on that dude's head. Yep, that's us. Ah, <laughs> uh, look at, look at that the character design. I love it. Yikes indeed, bangers. Yikes indeed. I'm so sorry. They don't mean any harm. I mean they were gonna they told us to meet our maker. I'm pretty sure they did mean harm. Been through a lot lately. Ask around for yourselves. You'll see. Okay. There's nothing wrong with the place, mind. It's a lovely village, really. Make yourselves at home. The soundtrack in this is awesome. I've heard that the soundtrack on the PS2 version is actually better than the 3DS one because they had to kind of like compress it a bit, but still pretty good. Hey, where's the dude that sells? Oh, is it nighttime? I think it could be nighttime. <laughs> Probably should stay at the inn. Oh, is this a well? Can we go down the well? Yeah. All right. Let's see what we can find down this well. Nothing. <laughs> there was nothing down there. All right, cool. Well. There's gotta be something around. <gasps> is that a cat? Oh. Wait. Is it now daytime? 
Where'd the cat go? Damn it. I want to pet the cat. So mean. Alright, so at least the vendors are here now, so we can buy some stuff. They might have better weapons. Alright, you. Weapon shop, dude. Uh, buy. Yeah, let's buy some stuff. Hell yeah. Oaken club. Which are, oh, oh, ooh, stone axe. I think that's for Yangus, right? Oh, I could get the boomerang. Bo boomerang? Boomerang. I could get the boomerang. But I feel like the stone axe is going to be better for Yangus, just in general. I get the copper sword. I mean, copper sword doesn't really sound that great. But it's better than what I have. Ah, oh, but I want the boomerang. So good. But I'm not going to specialize in boomerangs, but I just want it. Because boomerangs are cool. But I'm going to buy the stone axe for Yangus. Because that's the most expensive. And Yangus is a bit of a tank already. And he also has a special attack already for axes. So we're going to give him that. Alright, sweet. Can we sell... I think we should probably sell Yangus's like, oaken club or whatever we had him have before. What did he have? Giant mallet. There we go. Cool. Yeah. Sell that. Awesome. Probably should get some more, like, weapon... Uh, more armor, I should say. Can I... I can still afford the copper sword, but I want to see what other, like, kind of stuff we can get from this dude. <laughs> this guy just reminds me of... If you guys have seen, uh, like, the bit in Dragon Quest XI where, like, you get Puff Puff in, the, like, one of the towns, and this guy, like, the same character sprite gives it to you as this guy. Every time I see them now, that's all I can think of. Alright, let's see what I can... What do we need? Leather Kilt... Scale shield, medicinal herb, holy water, chimera wing. So scale armor is kind of where we need to go. Hmm. But we can probably just like grind some gold for that. That'd be pretty good. And the leather kilt for Yangus? Yeah, that could be pretty good. New shields would be good too. Okay. Um Yeah, I think I'll get the scale armor. Hopefully we can get the copper sword as well. That would be really nice. Alright, so what's wrong with this village? Hello there, travelers. Welcome to Oh, this is Alexandria. Dolmagus. Hmm, sorry, I've never heard of him. Okay, well, you're useful. Alright, so, we've been down the well. We've been to this shop. What's this? Oh, this is the inn over here. Well, we don't have to go to the inn anymore because it's daytime. Ah, uh, I've seen something that I'm excited about. The cat! Yes. Come here. Meow. Okay, that was worth it. I don't know what it is. The cats in Dragon Quest are always cute. Like, super cute. Alright, smash these pots. Give me gold. I mean, holy water's okay pretty good and uh, so I think we're gonna go to this big house up here yeah that looks pretty cool all right so spoilers um, Jessica the person mentioned before will be someone who'll be joining our party um, it's pretty classic everyone knows if they've ever seen this game they, they will know that but uh, yeah pretty keen because I didn't actually don't they actually got Jessica to join my party last time well this house looks very cool let's steal everything inside um, yeah, because I didn't actually play that much of the game last time, so. Oh, cool. Oh, smash these pot. How small is this dude? There's a secret, uh, wait, there's a secret to the door of the Eastern Tower. Only people from our village know how to open it. But Master Alistair found a way to open it one day, and th that's why he went inside to find out what was going on. And then someone or something attacked him, and oh, it's so unfair. Oh. Oh, a piece of cheese. Hell yeah. I mean, makes sense. <gasps> Five gold coins, yeah. Just robbing this house. Alright, there must be someone we can talk to in this house. Uh, I just don't think it's just a loot. You know, stealing loot house. Okay, well, we'll ask the guard. There was never uh, any need for a guard in here in the past. I was hired just after Master Alistair died, so I'm still quite new here, really. Doesn't mean I'll be putting up with any shenanigans, though. Make sure you behave inside the mansion. Do you hear? Well, I mean, you're not stopping me from stealing, so that's a pretty big shenanigan. Ah, here we go. Let's chat to her. Oh, Rosalind Albert. Okay, cool. Now that my family is currently in mourning, no one is permitted to set foot outside the house. I'm afraid that my daughter is less than happy about this arrangement and has confined herself to her room. He's even asked those boys to stand guard at the door. I'm sure I don't know what's good in- Okay, ah, that's what those guys were doing. Ooh, is this free armor? Very impressive suit of armor, proudly displayed. It certainly looks well used, but in no way lacks luster when where it now stands. Cool, I like it. Alright kids, get out of the way. Look a bit 
You look a bit like thieves to me. I bet you are. I'm never wrong either. Well, I mean, I did just steal stuff. But you're not wrong. All right, kid. Oh, it's you. I'm sorry about the fall, but not sorry enough to let you through here. I'm under order. See, Jessica said she doesn't want to see anyone, so I can't let people through. Hmm. Okay. Wait, do we talk to this? Who's... Holy crap, who's this dude? Wait. Oh, no. Aha! Congratulations! You have the great pleasure of meeting... Oh, someone. I... Obviously... I'm the son of the Chancellor to the large and prosperous... Oh, to a large and prosperous kingdom, but I'm also the lovely Jessica's fiancé. Yes, that's me. He looks psycho. But look at him! She lost her brother recently, so I came here today to comfort her, but I seem to be faced with an unexpected obstacle to our love. There are some brats in front of her room who won't let me in. Ah, the sea of true love is strewn with the flotsam of despair. Okay, fair enough. But I shall crest the waves of adversity and find harbour in my lady's bosom. You, you need to be killed. <laughs> that guy is just wrong. Okay. Oh, what's this? Eh, come on. There we go. Flick through. It's a book entitled Cheeses of the World. Uh, the world in we- okay, blah blah blah, cheese. Yummy cheese. <laughs> that's all- that's all you need to say. Cheese yum, good, bye. Okay, so there must be someone we can talk to to get through that door. Because otherwise it's kind of pointless, right? Okay, you, servant. Uh, okay, blah, okay. Oh, wait, here we go. Oh, wait. Oh dear, listen to me. If the mistress heard me, I'd be out of my ear. Then I'd have no choice to but to travel. <laughs> okay. Okay. Cool. I thought that was going to be something exciting. Hey, you. To be honest, I never really liked Miss Jessica all that much. Uh, don't tell anyone I said so. It's just she's never very friendly to us house staff, and she's always arguing with her poor mother. But I do have sympathies with her. I mean, her only true friend in the world was her brother, Miss Master Alistair. So now she's all alone. Oh. That sucks. Alright. Alright, let's open this door. Yeah. Wait, oh. Wait, whose room is this? Cool, let's steal it. Yeah, open the cupboards. Wait, there's nothing in there? Ah, what a stupid house. There's only like five gold pieces in this house. Okay. So I guess we talk to the mother again. Maybe she'll say something different now. Okay, exactly the same thing. Okay, yep. Okay, I talked to you already. Shush. Shush. Get out of here. Okay, I'm going to leave. Um, because I don't think there's anything we can really... Wait, can we talk to Yangus? What does Yangus have to say? Everyone here seems a bit down the dumps, don't they? There ain't no sign of Joel Megus, though. Maybe something else is bothering them. Yeah, thanks. Alright. Oh, wait, there's a door here. Did we miss... Did we literally missed this door. Oh, okay. What's in here? Nothing. Is there anything in these? Oh, Wayfarer's clothes. Hell yeah. <laughs> just stealing clothes from this house. Oh, here we go. This is not too bad. Aha, stairs up. Damn, this is a pretty dope room. Okay, keep smashing stuff in front of the maid. Oh, okay. Oh. Okay, this is where we're meant to go. Oh, a mouse? Oh, there's a mouse. I love the sound effect, it's so cute. <gasps> oh, there's a hole! Ah, I think I know what we have to do now. See? What am I going to do? Oh my god, send the mouse in. Yeah. Okay, okay. Yep. Okay, I want to smash stuff to- Oh, stop let- Okay, cool. I don't want to talk to you, I want to smash this barrel. Thank you. This is a pretty cool room though. Ooh, seed of magic, hell yeah. Oh wow, there's so many barrels to smash. Smash all the barrels, please. 18 gold. Not bad, not bad. Perfect. Well, we've only died twice this playthrough, so that's kind of nice. A moonwort. I don't know what that does. But look, there's a little hole here, so I guess we can send Munchie through. Yeah. Yes. Let's do it. This is going to be terrifying. We get to play as Munchie? Oh, I totally forgot about this. Ah, oh, so cute. Oh. Okay, Munchie. I like how Munchie's got his own theme. Whee! 
so cute. All right, what are we meant to do with Munchie? Just giant bags and stuff in here, so Munchie doesn't really care about those. <laughs> I love the Munchie theme, so cute. All right, I guess we have to go down these stairs. Wait, so this is, this is Jessica's room. Oh, I guess we can just like scare her out, right? <laughs> Look at him jumping down the stairs, it's so cute. Ooh, a letter. Nice. Perfect. How do, oh, wait, we go up this. Wait. What is with this broom? This is a real weird broom. <laughs> Munchie's struggling. <gasps> Look, there's the other rat. Hello. <laughs> it's a letter. Yes, take it, Munchie. Munchie just eats it. What else can we find in here? Where is Jessica? She's not in here. Oh, she's not a runner! Oh, no! Um, how do I get up the stairs? Can Munchie jump? I can just roll. Okay. I didn't realize I'm now stuck in the room. Alright, Munchie. You can do it. I'm guessing we have to... There must be some way of getting out of here. Um... Okay, we can do like a cute little roll thing. Maybe it's up here. Okay, Munchie, just be normal. Okay, what do we do here? Oh, do we like push the chair? Nope. Okay, we can't push the chair. Am I just being an idiot? Oh, can we just go up the rails? <laughs> I'm such an idiot. All right, come on. Roll it, Munchie. Roll, yeah, do that cool roll. I love the little roll, it's so cute. This game has it all. Cool mouse companions. There we go. Perfect. We got the letter. Hey! Blake takes the letter and reads it. I don't know who will find this letter, but please consider it my last will and testament, for the, by the time you read this, I'll already be gone. I'm going to the tower in the east. I will not return until my brother's death is avenged. Mother, I'm sorry for the damage I've caused to our family's reputation, but this is about something far bigger than tradition. I must follow my heart no matter the consequences. Please forgive me. And to bang is a mash, I'm sorry for lying to you. I hope you'll forgive me as well. Signed, Jessica. Okay. I think I know where we're going next. We're gonna go back to that stupid tower. <laughs> Damn it. Alright, do we talk to the... We gotta talk to bang is a mash, right? Hey, where is everyone? Huh. Okay, kids. Uh, okay. What? She's not in her room? I knew you were dodgy from the first moment I saw you. I don't think you can... <laughs> so, pro uh, so prove it. You can't just say something like that without proof. Are you a complete thicko or what? I mean, I have a letter. Okay. Well, I'll just let these kids keep... <laughs> keep guarding an empty room. Alright. Wait, the guard's gone as well? Wait, what's going on here? Oh, okay. They're eating. Oh, okay. Cool. Well, wait, is it nighttime or something? I'm guessing it must be nighttime or something. No. Oh, well. You know what? I think I might leave it there, and next time we're going to try and do the tower. Because the tower bit sounds pretty fun, so. Uh, it's going to be a dungeon, I guess. Oh, there we go. Change to nighttime. I think we'll go to the inn, and then we'll finish it. <laughs> But yeah, thank you so much for hanging out, everyone. Uh, you guys are awesome, and uh, thank you so much for all the support you've been giving me on all the platforms that I'm on doing stupid things. And uh, yeah, I hope I'll catch you next time. Um, I'm going to be dropping these fairly fairly regularly. So, And keep a lookout. I'm going to be dropping some, some other little cheeky videos uh, sometime this week. So, Anyways, I'll catch you guys next time. Thank you so much for hanging out.